Hi, I'm Miriam. I've been a uh, beekeeper until I was two. Until you're two? Yeah. Pretty much born and raised? Yeah. You're going to be a master queen breeder someday? Yeah. Because you've been making queens for how long? Uh, you remember the first queens? No. No? Okay. Well, we're back at Barb's house. And we're going to go through and see what kind of mess we made last time we were here. I see activity. It did just rain not too long ago. I'm pretty sure we got a queenless colony because uh, Barb said that they were getting kind of aggressive yesterday. So that probably means we got a queenless colony. But we're going to go through them. I'm not seeing activity in all of them, so I don't know. Hopefully I just didn't make a mess. But, all right, let's take a look. I'll go smoke that one at the end, huh? Is this one? One down there at the end, yeah. Yep. Stick it right in there and smoke them. Like in the hole? Yep, right in the hole. You don't generally do the smoking. But. Oh, right down at the bottom, honey. Where you see the bees coming and going. Yeah. Yep, right there. Just squirt it full of smoke. Oh, good job. Yeah, that's a good job. Yep. Just set it on top. I'll squirt it some more in there. Well, the gloves still covering pollen sub for the old pollen sub destructor yesterday. Or the other day. You get a little closer, you can see something. That's my granddaughter, by the way. She got an award for math, didn't yeah. she? Yeah. That was awesome. This one here was a walk away split. So we never put a queen in it. We just let them make their own. I don't generally do that, but looks like the nest is off to the side, so we're going to have to center it. Marion's going to be my assistant. These look, uh, I know they got a queen just by the way they're acting. Wait, would queens sting? Now how the heck, oh, wait a minute. Now I am confused. Why is there a red queen? How did the... That is the Russian queen, eh? Isn't that the Russian queen? How did she end up down there? She was in that box. She must Maybe. have gone to... Maybe she moved. <laughs> yeah, she did. She moved boxes. Yeah. <laughs> Say, I'm tired of these... Um, these beans. Well, no wonder they're so happy. <laughs> I thought they were being mad. She's like, that's going to be a slab of brood right there. Alright. Well, I guess she wants to live down here. We're going to move the brood nest over a little bit. Yeah, the queen probably moved. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. They must have absconded out of that one. Okay, that probably means there's no bees in this one. No, nope, there's bees in this one. This might be the queenless one. Now how in the heck did that queen end up down there? But yet, because that's where we put the Russian queen. We put it right there. This was, this was a, uh, this was making her own queen. She must have went over there and killed that one and then, she's the boss, man. These are probably queenless. 
Oh, maybe the queen just moved the other one because those are your bees are being lazy. Yeah, it's the brood's hatching out, but yeah, there's no eggs or nothing in there. So okay, so that's probably the reason why she's getting stung up. So we got to bring these guys a clean, probably some brood. Here, that are just some loose bees. Well, at least there's still bees in here. These are, this is going to be an easy fix right here. Okay, and then this one was where the, we first had the Russian Queen. Wait, it's all the little field? I don't know, I imagine. You can go walk out back and see your chickens. Right. But hurry back, you gotta be in the video, remember? Wow, that's actually a pretty nice box of bees right there. But did they make a queen? Well, they have emergency cells. But I don't think they have a queen. Are those are the swarm cells that haven't hatched yet? Mm -hmm. That's a good population. Mm -hmm. Got by how loud they are. They're really clean. Okay, so they're swinging. Those swarm cells, I think, should have hatched by now, but I'll look at my record. They are just starting to seal them, remember? And then this one. This one here is the one we set up to do honey, right? That was really weird how that queen went over in that hive. I don't get it. You know, there could have been like a war or something and they pushed them out or something. Hello, Barb. Hey. How's it going? Are they doing okay? You need more boxes? No. It needs to quit raining so we can make some honey. Yeah. I've been worried about this last box over here. Oh! Looks like got a box of honey. Oh yeah! Yay! Yay! Want to look at it? Oh no, you don't want to come over here. <laughs> How you doing, kiddo? Yeah. You missed me all. Oh, oh wow, look at that. I saw you. It's shaking nectar, too. Look at that. Look at the nectar count. Look, Barb. Ooh, it's nice and gold. Huh? <laughs> yeah, don't get stung. <laughs> Anyway, there's some beautiful honey right there. Bob Cap. Alright. I guess I should have smoked them, huh?
got a little carried away there. That's why they got worked up. I never smoked them, right? Frame to grab. I wouldn't mind grafting this queen. She's a pretty good one. Just beat the brew. Look at that. Oh, got blow up, boy. Oh, the nectar coming in today. It's coming in good today. You know it rains. Not even the outside brain is full of brew. Yeah. One of my nukes I brought down. in there and I see a couple eggs I guess. What if they're going through a queen replacement? Huh. These guys might be clean with That way. It's going to be huge. All that brood, I mean, there's like seven, eight frames. I mean, I'm talking sheets. I didn't start these until a few 
Made a box of honey though. That's good. Well, they look good. I don't see no eggs in there. It really wasn't a whole lot of place left in there. I just thought I'd Like they got a queen. Pretty mellow. No queen. Oh Got a bunch of uh, F1 VHS queens. I should bring them down here. This would be a good place to keep them. Keep them safe down here. And that one big hive acts like it's queenless. I don't know why it'd be queenless. A big one? Yeah. Full of brood, but yeah, see that form cell hat. That one has. There should be a queen in here somewhere. You need another box? No. Not seeing any eggs, but she might not be laying yet either. They act like they got a queen. See how calm they are? I mean, you can tell. Well, she's not laying yet. I think this one's got a queen. So does that other one, it was real mellow. But they're hard to spot until they start laying and then once they swell up. But there's a good population in here, holy moly. Yeah. Okay. You see that. Yeah, swarm cell hat. Look. See how calm they are too? Yeah, right. 
think you can see it or not. See how they chewed out the end? That's how you tell. Mm -hmm. It was chewed out through the side, and then the bees chewed her out. That's different. I think this one made a new queen, it just isn't laying yet. Yeah. And this guy, and this little piggy. If I'm gonna bring brood down, then... And then... If I'm gonna bring queens down, I should bring a little brood down and boost them. Do a little boosty food. Hopefully these guys made it queen. <laughs> yep. See hat. I'm gonna get rid of that now. Whoops. See if we can spot this one. Should be able to spot this one. They're calm. Yep, there she is right there. She's a beautiful queen. I don't want her to fly away, but she's running all over. She's right here. Beautiful. Dark queen. Russian queen. Hopefully she doesn't swarm on me. Okay, we're in business. do is I'll bring some paper and then uh, I'll put some frames of brood in the upper box and let them yeah, do so. give them a little boost because I mean they're too small they're only two or three frames of bees and they're on mediums at that so. well, actually I'm pretty satisfied I think, I think we have a couple that are queenless we had one jump the hive we had one jump the hive down here, and uh, yeah, I think I'll bring down some of those VHS queens down here. We'll put them down here. We'll put some more right here, but that's what I'll do. Yeah, looking good. This could be our treatment-free yard if we decided to have a treatment-free yard. Yeah, be a good spot to store some breeders. But anyway, or monitor how they do even. But anyway, that's what's going on down here at Barb's, Barb's yard. Thanks for watching.